Darren, I can't believe this day has come. I am so proud of you. Charlene, once how Preston signs these papers, our lives are set. See, that's why I married you. You're smart and you're handsome. Oh, look, I think I see the car come in. You must be Felipe. Uh, my cash. I got it. Cash, $350 plus tip. Yeah. Five, uh, five hours, $70 an hour. It's right here, yeah, it's uh, right here. Th that was the uh, cash only, and that was the arrangement. It's all there, it's all there. Felipe is quite the businessman, huh? When this deal is still pressing, you need to hire him. Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> nice rack. Excuse uh, me? Uh, the uh, bar rack has a uh, Clear glasses and ice. Um, and you have the directions and the information to where we're going? I got it from your email. Okay. Wow, three bottles of Dom. I'm gonna remember this on our anniversary. Well, this is a big night for us. So, have you ever got a little bit crazy in the back of the room? No, why have you? Yeah, what about boyfriend? Who'd you date? A rock band? Oh, loosen up. Come on, come on. Loosen up. Oh my god, this yeah, is crazy. I have a huge business meeting. We have at least 40 minutes. You know we can get this done in 40 minutes. What the hell they're doing back there? Hey guys! Nice knuckers. Honey, I can't see your headlights are on. Hey guys, I need to pick up my wife from the mall. How long is this gonna take? It will only take a minute. She'll right up front here with me. Just put the window up! Just put up the window! Иди он, куда мы едем? Что это за уроды там сидят? Я бросаю. Я бросаю тебя. Пусть трема. I'm not sure how impressed the person is going to be with all of this. I was just thinking the same thing, and I hope these two stop by the time we get there. I know this is ridiculous. It really is. Has arrived. What are you waiting for? It's open! Get in! I don't think he's going to open the door. Oh. <laughs> Hello, darling. Yeah. Alberta's been talking about you non-stop. I've been looking forward to meeting you so much. Very nice. And this is my wife, Charlene. Oh, hello, darling. Man. Oh, lovely. Hello. Oh, excuse me. Good Lord. Do you have the notarized documents? I sure do, right here in my briefcase. I've already signed mine and notarized myself. All we need is your signature, and my wife is a notary. Great, hand those puppies over. Let's get this done. I mean, how about some more champagne? Yes. All right. I'd like a little more. I'll send these originals to accounting first thing in the morning. You should have the funds in your account by 4 p.m. Uh, here, just uh, put them in your briefcase. I don't have any place to hold them. Um, uh, I don't want to misplace them, and uh, it'll take weeks to get new ones. Are we at the restaurant already? I didn't even finish my champagne. 
Hey guys. Good, they have their clothes on this time. <laughs> My wife just needs to run into this uh, store. It would only take a minute. Don't worry. Enjoy your champagne. I'll drive you fast. Get the one piece though, honey. Would you find this guy? Oh, I certainly would give him five stars or recommend him to Sir Elton. Hmm. Hey guys, if the cop asks, we're, we're just only friends going out for dinner. You're not paying me. You're not paying me. Got it? Got it? Hardwood Police Department. I can see you live up to your name. My cop cam has been activated for this stop, so I must advise you that all interactions are being recorded. So I'm on camera. Hunk, hunk. <laughs> How would you like to get handcuffed for that? That sounds fun. License, registration, and proof of insurance. Do you know why I stopped you? Because I'm handsome? No because you were doing 45 in a school zone. The speed limit is 25 back there. Also, I noticed your vehicle hasn't passed state inspection. Oh, I didn't know that. Look, Officer Busty, we're in a bit of a hair, we're in a bit of a hurry. Is there a problem with producing your documents? Get the papers out of the glove compartment. Hurry. Here, Busty. Are you operating a limousine business with this vehicle? Not at all. We're just friends. If you are, you need a commercial license plate, commercial insurance, and an endorsement on your driver's like license. Like I was saying, Busty, we're just friends going out to dinner. Do you always wear a bow tie when you go to dinner? He wears bow ties all the time. Sometimes that all he wears to bed. He used to be an exotic dancer. She loves it when I do the Danish helicopter dance Enough, I don't need to hear anymore. I'm issuing you the summons for speeding and also failure to inspect your vehicle. I'll be right back. Hey guys, I'm going to drive my wife home. I'll be back before you order dessert. the sweetest meatballs for you. Thank you. Bon appetit. Thank you. So authentic. Yes. yes. So okay. Enjoy everyone. That dinner was amazing. It really was. It's really authentic. Is anybody gonna have dessert? Oh darling I've had dessert for years. Really? I guess that means Felipe's on his way then. <laughs> Speaking of that, I think uh, my wife and I are going to take our own car back home. After listening to what the police officer said, I don't want to get back in that thing. Well, I already took care of it. I've already called for a car to take us all home. And you guys, I am so sorry. I cannot apologize enough. And you don't really know how I feel about that limousine. It was a lovely gesture. It's not your fault. 
I'll just let Felipe know that we're not gonna use him anymore. He's paid in full, so he shouldn't mind. He shouldn't. Hey, Felipe, there's been a change of plans. We're not gonna need your car anymore, but you're all paid up for the night, so you should be good. What? You're canceling me? I want a hundred dollar tip. I'm not gonna I'm tip you. I'm hundred dollar tip. I got a ticket because you make me drive fast. I want a hundred dollar tip, you tip. asshole. You know what, Felipe, go fuck yourself. I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm fine. Just let him go. I just hope to never deal with him again. That was ridiculous. Hello and welcome to the show. home. Come here, my little Slavic cupcake. I have champagne for us. Is that the expensive one? Of course it is. Oh, oh, Felipe bear other gifts. Ooh, I love when you talk money, my oui, French oui. baguette. What show. else did you get me? Did you get me the Hermes scarf I've been waiting for, my little croissant? Not I yet, know, my little Arctic princess. Who the hell is calling me now? Who the hell is this? Move over. Hey, Felipe, you have my belongings in the back of your car, and I really need them. Is this the big tipper? What belongings? What are you talking about? My briefcase and the two bottles of champagne. You know you have them there. I'm not in the mood to play games. I have your briefcase, asshole. I'm all the way down in Atlantic City now. Your two bottles of champagne are broken. You must have broken them. How in the hell can you be in Atlantic City in 30 minutes? It's a three hour drive. You're so full of shit, Felipe. Are you calling me a liar? Listen up, not nuts. If you want me to drive back all the way to the restaurant, it's gonna cost you. How much? $500 cash or the briefcase goes missing. All right, just meet us back. We're still at the restaurant. I need them. I'm on my way. $500 cash. Thank you. And Jerko, and good night. don't try anything funny or the briefcase is toast. You got it? You're listening? Felipe always wins. Let that